Oh yes. Good morning. Today I will be demonstrating how to replace a broken duplex receptacle. First off, we will need to check if this receptacle is energized. You cannot operate on an energized circuit as per OSHA and the NFPA 70, which is the electrician's code book. To test this, we will use a plug-in tester manufactured by Greeley. We plug it into the receptacle, and as you can see, the three lights have not turned on. This means the receptacle is de-energized. If these three lights were to turn on, the receptacle is energized, and we would have to turn it off at the power source, which would be a circuit breaker or a fuse. Next, I will remove the receptacle cover. to allow access to the receptacle. As you can see here, this receptacle is broken. Next, we will remove two 832 screws that affix the receptacle to the non-metallic outlet box installed behind this wall. Next, we will remove the receptacle straight out of the outlet box and detach the wires from the 10 screws on the side. We have successfully uninstalled the broken receptacle and it can now be discarded and replaced with a new duplex receptacle. I will now reattach the wires to the new duplex receptacle using a torque screwdriver. This torque screwdriver is set to 7 pounds per inch and must be used as per the NFPA 70 <coughs> Annex I Table 1.2 to ensure that the screw is sufficiently tightened around each conductor. And we will turn this until we hear a click. And this click means the screw has been sufficiently tightened to seven pounds per inch. And we will continue to do this until all conductors are reinstalled. Once again, we will tighten the screw sufficiently.
and once again until you hear the click. And the screws are sufficiently tightened. Now we will carefully fold the wires to the back of the box, the non-metallic outlet box that is nailed on behind this wall. Proper folding of these wires is important as it is not only a courtesy to the next electrician, but it also prevents damage to the conductors that can result in a short circuit. We will place it in, ensure it is straight and neat, and we will reinstall the receptacle into the outlet box. Once again, all right. While you're doing this, it is always helpful to stop and ensure that the receptacle is straight, as to please the homeowner. The important part of electricity is that it's not only a technical skill, but your work must also be aesthetically pleasing to satisfy the homeowner, as opposed to technically pleasing to satisfy inspectors and any employers who may be reviewing your work. As you can see, we have secured the receptacle, and now we will be covering it once again. You place the plate over the receptacle, and install the one screw in the center using a straight blade screwdriver. Ensure the cover is straight. And now, I have successfully removed and replaced a broken duplex receptacle, and as soon as this is energized at a circuit breaker, it will be ready for use in the home. Thank you.